I'm Molly Stanberry with a tutorial about how to receive your Gmail messages within Leopard's Mail to application. There are actually a couple of ways to get your Gmail to Apple Mail. The first is to simply forward it. To forward your Gmail, click on Settings in the upper right-hand corner of the browser window. In Settings, click on the Forwarding and Pop IMAP tab. Select the Forward a copy of incoming mail to radio button. Next, enter the email address that you want to forward your Gmail to and then select what you want Gmail to do with your message once it's been forwarded. We'll select Archive Gmail's copy. The second way to get your Gmail into Apple Mail is to directly access it via a POP account. To download your Gmail messages directly in Apple Mail, first open your Gmail account in a browser window. Click on Settings in the upper right-hand corner of the browser window. In Settings, click on the Forwarding and POP slash IMAP tab. Next, go down to POP Download Settings and select the Enable POP for All Mail radio button. We're going to select Archive Gmail's copy from the When Messages Are Accessed with POP pull-down menu. Next, we have to configure Apple Mail to access the Gmail account. Open Apple Mail. Click Mail on the menu bar and select Preferences. Open the Accounts tab, click the plus sign along the bottom to add a new account. In the New Account Setup window, enter a name for the account. Then enter your Gmail username, including at gmail.com, in the Email Address field. Enter your Gmail password in the Password field. Select the Automatically Set Up Account checkbox and click on the Create button. Next, select the Gmail account under the Accounts menu. Go to the Outgoing Mail Server, SMTP, pull down menu and click on the Edit Server List item. Make sure that the smtp.gmail.com account is highlighted. Under the Advanced tab, enter 587 in the Server Port field. Check the box next to Use Secure Sockets Layer, SSL. Select Password next to Authentication and enter your Gmail username including at gmail.com and Gmail password. Click OK. Next, click Advanced and check the box next to Use SSL. The port changes to 995. Click on the red window close button and then click on Save when the Save Changes dialog box pops up. Finally, go back to the Gmail settings window in your browser and click Save Changes. This is Molly Stanberry. Be sure to check the MacMost.com website for more helpful tutorials.